I'm back. Any nigga got a problem with it? All right, so look, man. Now I just seen one of the most disturbing videos I've come across in a long time. Now we all know NBA Young Boy. That's my guy, right? He's the meanest rapper in hip hop. I'm mad. I'm upset. 4K Trey, Grave Digger Mountain. I label him the maddest rapper in hip hop. And we got Kevin Gates. That's my guy as well. He's the freakiest rapper in hip hop. The dude tried to get a girl to give his dog some head. Like his literal dog, Roof Roof. You something else to even want somebody to do that, right? And now, we might have the creepiest rapper in hip hop. And this dude named Lil Boom, right? I first heard about him, man. It was years ago. Uh, it was when Steph Curry was on the rise. He made like an F Steph Curry song. It went viral. And that's pretty much it. I never really heard anything else from, from him since then, right? But I do watch DJ Academics time for time, so I do see him uh, having a relationship with DJ Academics. But literally, that's all I know about the guy. Up until now, the guy's a creep. Now, I usually give 10 on Jake a hard time, right? Because I'm not a fan of, oh, let me snitch on the snitch. Let me tell on the teller. But when he exposed people like this, hey, bravo. Do more videos like this. You about to make me subscribe. So instead of exposing a rapper for having paperwork, this video, 10 on Jake exposed Lil Boom for being a creep. The guy was walking around Walmart. I'm going to say allegedly. But clearly the security footage shows him allegedly touching underage girls. One was 10 years old, another one was 17 years old. And when I say touching, uh, the exact verbiage for it was he grabbed their bucks. Like a grown man. That's what he was doing at Walmart. Walking around grabbing bucks. Not only bucks, but underage bucks. Disgusting, right? But see, those two incidents, you couldn't really see him, I guess, grabbing their butts it was only in the report that the underage girl said that's what he was doing but you could clearly see he was being the creep following them around the store brushing up against them and things like that but this other footage that just dropped it's no question at all this guy's a creep first of all he's in the cosmetic aisle of walmart and in the security footage you can clearly see him pulling out his phone and recording underneath the girl butt while she's bending over shopping. I'm gonna be real, I don't even feel comfortable continuing to talk about this. Long story short, the dude the creep. Somehow all of this is just now coming to the light three years later, but man, this one definitely rubbed me the wrong way. And I bet he done had so many uh moments where he spoke about P. Diddy. What's the other guy, uh, EDP, or whatever his name is, I don't know. R. Kelly, Bill Cosby. And here you are walking around Walmart grabbing underage bucks and taking videos of people alleged you got to be careful who you invite around you and your family man just because a person can make you laugh he he and ha ha doesn't mean they're good people just remember that but anyway man how y'all feel about this let me know in the comment section bro like comment subscribe hit that notification bell man hey man follow me on instagram tzl baby 252 i'm gone Hey, bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street.